We're here in the P-8 Poseidon, which is the Navy's maritime aircraft focused primarily on anti-submarine warfare. Uh, they also do some search and rescue, which some might have seen during hurricane season, which is also interesting. The airframe of this aircraft is based on the Boeing 737 commercial aircraft, which explains just the sheer mass inside as well as outside of the P-8. So some interesting information on this is the Navy right now is in contract with Boeing for about 117 aircraft. They told Reuters recently that they're probably going to end up upping that by another 21 aircraft, which would keep them in production until about 2025. Uh, Boeing shares maintenance of the airframe with AAR. The two companies compete every year for a share of that workload. First year, the majority was done by Boeing. They just awarded the second year, majority is going to be done by AAR. Um, in terms of the kind of weaponry you have on here, they drop the sono buoys is basically how this functions. Um, in terms of the weapons, there's harpoons, there's torpedoes, and we have three different sections within the aircraft um, for managing that. We have someone that's looking on the surface um, in terms of the environment during an operation. There's someone that's checking underwater in terms of the sonar that's happening that they can get from the sauna buoys. That data then is transferred to someone that puts all of the data together, figures out how it's functioning, what they need to know based on the mission, and will decide what kind of weaponry might be needed and how to proceed and they transfer that data to the pilot who can control the actual unloading of weapons as needed for a given mission. Um, interesting point here also is that this is the same airframe that Boeing had planned to use for the JSTARS recapitalization program for the Air Force, which was going to provide ISR capabilities and replace a legacy aircraft from Northrop. That program was of course scrapped last year and is no longer happening. From inside the PA, I'm July Toro, Defense News.